Hello everyone and welcome to Adapt, an adorable little game made by Paul Hervey and Slug Disco Studios. This is a charming little game that is very early in development, currently in early access and this is the demo available for free from Steam. This is a bit like a small creature state experience, though currently with a lot less features but like I said, brand new, early development, but the music and sounds really make up for it, this game is absolutely adorable. Now what we have here is my Indocanth which was a random creature I made beforehand to try out the editor because yes it's is an editor. You can customize your own creatures. And this is my little herbivore so that I can get used to the mechanics and just the way the game works. And this here is my Rexy, another little experimental creature. Uh, I call it Rexy because at one point I was able to kind of bug it out. Oh, there you go. Make it bipedal. It's not supposed to be like that, but it is for some strange reason. It's my cute little T-Rex. And so for this demonstration with you guys, I'm going to make it a creature I've been really resisting making before. And that is, of course, the Jowie. So let's start off then by changing the body around a little bit and see what my options are. I want like a nice, uh, I'd say like a bit of a thin body like that kind of works out quite nicely. I've already got a, a nice long neck but I'll go ahead and see for any more options. Oh, <laughs> that's too long though I like the option. I like how that is actually an available thing. The head which allows for gripping, in other words carnivore, is probably already the best option that I can get for this. The eyes, in terms of eyes, I can have, ooh, some soulless ones like any pupils. Oh, really big ones! <laughs> so while I do prefer the pupil from these ones, the other option here is just, look, that's, that's way more jowy. The eyes are huge. Of course I've got to have this one. Now next up are the feet. For the feet, I would like, uh, let's see, now if I get rid of these ones here, I kind of want some like this. Although that might not be quite right. Now, so like I said a moment ago with the Rexy, uh, the game doesn't really support arms just yet. So we only have various types of legs. As you can see here, we can have arthropod legs. We can allow fin flaps for better swimming. And that does allow you to kind of crawl along the floor as well. But I am definitely after my terrestrial feed to have improved speed and stamina on land. As mentioned, I can't have a bipedal Jowie, but fortunately, I've always imagined that wild Jowie would be adaptopeds, as I like to call it, where they can walk bipedal and quadruped. Imagine the Indoraptor in Jurassic World. So it's got the nice big legs, the little small arms. If I could, I'd make the feet bigger, but alas, I cannot. I currently have a tail fin, again, for better swimming. My options are long tail, which allows for better movement speed, or short tail, which currently doesn't have a benefit, I think, other than just appearances. But you can see you can have like a little bunny tail, a little ungulate tail as well. But for mine, I definitely want the long tail. And I think... <laughs> you can also have like this little funny looking thing. Now, I think this one's definitely gonna be the most fitting one once again. I suppose if I wanted to be cheeky, I could glitch it out and do this. So <laughs> now it is a biped, but it looks... A little bit uncanny, doesn't it? Yeah, I think we're just gonna go with the Indoraptor stance on this one. And now that the base of my creature is complete, I can look into details. I can look into sensory and flare. Now, once again, the options are currently quite slim because again, very simple game, very early access, but it's got such lovely potential. So first of all, typical Jowie. Oh, there's different type of horns. There's antlers and regular horns. So I'm gonna want some regular horns on this one, which will give me extra pierce, which means extra attack damage and it counters reflex. Now, which kind of horns do I want here? I could have big steer horns, I could have big curly ones, straight buffalo ones, or little small ones. I think I'll go for the buffalo ones and see if I can try and finagle the game to convince it, exactly like that, convince it to be backwards. Uh, not quite the right shape for a Jowie, but it's going to be familiar enough. Oh, there we go, just like that. Now, if I could flip it upside down, that'd be perfect, but... <laughs> Again, not an option just yet, but I can have frills. Yes, you can absolutely have frills. This is far too much of a big deal for me. I'm very, very happy. So I'm gonna have one frill right there and another one down below right there. And then for the big spine, I'll be adding some of these smaller frills, the little triangular ones into a kind of a pattern to try and mimic the spine. Now, unfortunately I can't add any on the tail. So you're not gonna get a big trademark, you know, flowy jowy tail, but hey, once I, oh, and of course the mohawk. I, how could I forget the mohawk? So add a couple more of these little triangular ones down here. Right, and there we have it then. So with a little bit of tweaking, my Jowie is complete. So I can go ahead and name this the Jowie Sarah. Now, I'm sure that for those of you who are familiar with Adapt, you'll probably notice I am way over my DNA budget. That was intended because I wanted to show what is possible with this and come on, of course I had to make a Jowie. Of course I had to. That's really cool though to see like the potential of this game in the future. 
Now, as for making a playable creature, I'm gonna have to purge my parts just a little bit. So maybe I'll get rid of the mohawk then. And now we are ready to proceed to the game itself. Now, first of all, I'm just gonna quickly save a copy of it. There we go. So I always have my very own Jerry Sarah. So here we go then. The first thing I need to do is place a location for my nest. Now, oh wow. I don't actually know what survival score really means, but this is the highest I've ever seen it at. 98, I think I saw just then. Right, lovely. Now go ahead then and start my new life as the Jerry Sarah. So, thankfully, as a carnivore, it gives me some meat straight off the bat because uh, <laughs> this game is savage as a carnivore. I've played a little bit as a herbivore in the past, but carnivore is kind of terrifying. But here we go. We have my very own little Jerry. And the sounds they make is absolutely adorable. So first I'm going to do then is just store a bunch of my meat because I am, like I said, I'm going to need it. And hopefully I can find someone to interact with. Oh, and as you can see right here, there's a little insect right next to me that I can actually pick up and grab. <laughs> and as you see, I'm just carrying my little insect. Now, technically, law-wise, Jowies are insectivores. Well, I guess omnivores more accurate, but I would totally eat, eat insects. But unfortunately, as a carnivore in this game, if I were to eat that, it would actually harm me. And because meat can be kind of hard to come by, I'm not going to demonstrate. Take my word for it. Eating the wrong food will harm you. We have something over there. Let's go have a little looky then, shall we? We're currently in alert mode. You can tell by the yellow explanation point down below. I can also switch to social and aggressive, but I'm going to remain alert and this will allow me to also scan things in a nearby area. So I can see all the foliage nearby, which is great for a herbivore, but I can see with my eyes this thing over here. What are you? So I can sing to it and it seems to be a very young adult. Whereas I, as you can tell here, oh wait, no, I am a baby. You can tell by my little growth line there to the left. Oh, camera got a little bit awkward there. So this is a really interesting looking creature. Did there? It's like a funky little um, arachnid thing. The body pattern, the body texture is really cool. Actually, I've not seen one before. Some kind of armor, I think. Oh, we've got another one of these creatures over there. Another funky little arachnoid friend, but that one seems to be very alert. So I'm going to set myself to alert as well. You are hostile. It's fast. It's strong. It's coming for me. It's not the same as what we had before. But you know what then? Let's take it on. Now, because I've got all my frills, I actually have the ability to threaten creatures, so I can run up to it. Oh, and I... Oh, there we go. <laughs> and I can just scream at it. Oh, this creature seems to be just sitting around doing nothing, so we're going to go ahead and focus. I'm going to chase it down. I'm just going to kill it. Because after all, we are a predator. <laughs> and keep on squawking just because I can. Wow, okay, my Jerry did a ton of damage really quickly, but this creature might be outrunning me. Oh, and I'm already very hungry. I didn't even realise. I lost my hunger immediately. Well, thankfully, we're about aha, to kill this creature. And uh, don't mind me just casually eating underwater. Totally normal. So there we go then. I was nearly starving. Like I said, being a carnivore in this game is kind of savage. I also may have just not eaten my first snack. Um, I was too busy, you know, showing the gameplay. And uh, yeah, in case you're wondering, you absolutely can swim in the water in this game. And as I mentioned in the editor, there are various swimming parts. So you definitely can spend a life underwater. You've got some herbivorous food right here. That right there is more herbivorous. Oh, that is insectivore food. Actually, you can tell by the little icon. So what do we have over there then? It is neutral. Is that the same arachnoid creature I found earlier? I think it is actually. Yeah, it's got like the big shelly thing. It looks like it's crawling on the sea floor, which is actually really cool. Oh, what do we have over here then? Ah, another insectivorous... Well, it's all jellyfish actually, so insectivore food. Which again, if I eat the jellyfish, it will harm me. Oh, look at you! Aren't you interesting? You are very different to the previous creature. You are moderately fast, but very low damage. Hmm. How's my hunger? You know what? I'm a predator. I'm gonna go ahead and eat you. Oh, half health. Oh, you are very tanky actually. Oh, and you are now suddenly very quick. Oh no. I think my jarry's got a chance because this little turd keeps on <laughs> turning towards me. See it like that? Hey, nom. And I think I need one more bit of nom. This one's got a lot of HP though, damn. Come on, let me get you, let me get you. There's another creature to my left. I think it's hostile. And chomp. There we go. And it's time for a rewarding snack. As any strong hunter should have. Right then, then grab you. So what are you over there then? You, I think, are hostile. You are hostile. You have maximum damage and no speed. But thankfully, I'm at full HP because nothing's been attacking me so far. It's a cool looking creature down there, isn't it? Let's go ahead then. And if I investigate... We get a closer look. It's like an interesting little um, reindeer friend. 
Oh, it's got a little ankylosaur tail. How cool is that? I've actually not seen that part before. I've been thinking that some of the parts I've been seeing so far, such as the uh, the harsh armor on the ones I just killed, I wonder that maybe I just missed that, but no, I've definitely not seen the ankylosaur tail before. Right, I wonder that's something I have to unlock then. Well, in any case, I don't want to attack it, but I just want to run up to it and scream. Oh god, it does a ton of- oh Jesus, that really hurt. God, it does a ton of damage. I'm just gonna run. Are you following me? Not yet. But I have seen it in this game, creatures can be quite, um, quite ruthless as you just saw just there. And they will chase you down. I'm gonna run, I'm gonna get back to my little nest, and I'm gonna quickly eat the rest of my food. Oh god. Ooh. I'm injured and there's another hostile creature over there. That is not good for me at all. So if I get into a social, I can investigate it. There we go. Yeah, another hostile creature all over there. With more, you know, really high attack damage. Oh, socializing. Interesting. And it's hungry. Yep, don't want to go near the hungry thing. <laughs> I'm just going to move the hell away from that. <gasps> I'm back home and I see another Jowie. Ah, oh, right. Well, first of all then... Um, I've learned this the hard way. Sometimes your own species will attack you if they are hungry and also if you are injured. So let's just go ahead then and have a bit of food. Why did I take a lot of damage? Oh, friendly. You're going to nick my food, aren't you? I'm very scared it's going to hit me because I've done that so many times in the past. Oh, do you want your gift? Here, here you go. Take gift. No, don't flee from me. Gift. Oh, it's damaged as well. Oh, no, it's also hurt. Hey, oh, you little wanker, what the hell? <laughs> I just tried to befriend him, but he bit me. What the hell? Oh my god. Oh, I am taking a ton of damage. Just, okay, you know what? Did I misunderstand something? I should be a carnivore. Oh, there you go. That's a bit of a delayed input there. That kind of made me a bit worried. Why? Why is my food hurting me? Oh, I don't want to attack my own Jowie, though. Mm, but I might not have a choice. Oh, it's so injured. Oh, it's dying. Oh, it died! Oh, that's okay. Is it. Did, will fresh meat help? Okay, right, I see now. So, the food in my nest actually is rotten. Okay, today I learned. I had no idea about that. But you saw the other one actually physically starved away. Oh, poor thing! But it shouldn't have bit me. God. I would have I fed it <laughs> if I could. There's another friend over here. Friend! Hello! Let me give you food. Gift. I see you're starving. There you go. So now we'll have that one. And now we're just eating it. So that should always should eat it. There you go. <laughs> right, there's some other food around here. So I don't need it just yet. I want to make a friend. Oh, I just dropped it. Oh no. Grab meat. There you go, friend. Give. And now I can focus and investigate. And you, oh, there you go. You're doing much better now. It is an adult. So look at that then, it's got a bit of attack, bit of def it's got no defense, fair bit of speed, no sneak, a bit of sense, and it's got seven of the threaten intimidate ability because of all the frills I have. Yeah, I may have given it uh, too many frills, but it was worth it. Right then, let's go ahead then and let go of that, and I'm gonna sing. Hello! Do you wanna be friends? I wanna be friends. We're befriending. Right, so long as it remains fed, we'll be friends. But the very moment I attack it, or I show any weakness, or it gets hungry, it will come for me. Even as an ally, it will still come for me. So if I want to have a strong ally that does not betray me, I'm going to make sure it's fed and happy. Meanwhile, my hunger isn't doing very well either, so I need to find something to hunt myself. It's another Jowie. Oh, I don't want to hunt more Jowies. There's two of them. There's a whole bunch of them. Oh, hello. Oh, I don't like her charging at me. But you're friendly. You're friendly, but you're in aggressive stance. Um, do not like. No. Nope. Ah, you're hungry. That's why. Oh god. <laughs> I'm still getting used to the commands. It is definitely coming for me. You, you know what? Screw off. Oh. Well, I did try to threaten, but we're just banging him instead, I guess. Uh, what's what's going on here then? Ow, you little wanker! There you go. Threaten. I tried to threaten several times. I think you actually have to mouse over the creature. You little bugger, come here then. I'll, I'll fight you. I'll fight you. I'll shank you. There we go. I need some snacks anyway. If you're going to go for me, I'll go for you. Wow, these are slow. Why are you so slow? Oh, there you go then. Well, <laughs> well, there you go then. I'm a cannibal now. It's running straight towards me. I'm terrified. Please, 
Take my gift. Take my gift. There you go. Uh, let's see. Yep, you're my ally, but you were also hungry. So I think it was uh, coming into attack there, but I managed to fend it off at just in time. We are allies, but I'm still vulnerable to betrayal. Oh, right. So I see a Jawi to the right, but I do see an aggressive creature to the left. Oh, and the aggressive creature is being hunted by the Jawi. But you know what? I'm going to be a bit... Op they're both fleeing from each other. I'm going to be a bit opportunistic. And I'm going to go ahead and just snipe his kill. Because I I will survive more than the AI. Let's go ahead and put you on focus. And we're going to chase you down, hunt you. I'll give like... I'll, I'll leave one food down for the other Jawi, which is currently over there. I only dropped two. That was a small little creature, wasn't it? There you go. You can have that one. <laughs> Mine. I'm gonna scavenge my way out of this. Oh no! Look! Which was my ally? <laughs> you see, like I said, cannibalism happens a lot here. Oh no, is my ally being chased? No, no, you will not get away with this. You are not gonna kill my ally. You, sir. I'm gonna gang up on you. Come on, attack. Oh, why is my camera turning so much? There we go. And there you go. See, it says friendly, but it's a complete lie. Hello, friend. There you go. We've got lots of meat. Oh, wow. Jowie's dropped a lot of meat. Nice. I'm going to go ahead and give that one to you then. Oh, no. You just nicked it from my mouth. Lovely. Thanks. Okay. It was a good thing I was going to feed you anyway. Ow. Do you too. Did you eat that one? Do a sing to you? Oh, there's one over there. Yeah, the man of Jowie's are scary. They're, they're, mate, they're angry. I'm going to go ahead and store my food over here then. I wouldn't be opposed to... Oh, all right. Fine. I guess you want this one too then. Jeez. <laughs> be opposed to um, feeding that one as well or getting another ally but as you can see this is pretty high maintenance and also if you didn't notice it's winter all the leaves have just vanished and uh, let me tell you this makes it very hard for a herbivore to survive as a herbivore you have to prepare for the winter it's really cool actually so over there we have a relatively okay jowie again just a little bit concerned I'm getting attacked oh it's charging straight for me I think. No, it's not. It's running in my direction. What are you doing? What are you doing? You're not going for my ally, are you? You better not be. Hey. No. I saw that little bite indicator. Yeah, screw you, mate. Fine, I'll go fight you as well then. Yeah, again, carnivores are ruthless in this game, man. Is that my friend? Oh, I don't think that's my ally. Hey. No, this is my food. You are definitely not my ally, are you? No, you are not my ally. Screw you, this is my food. Back off. Back off. Ow! No! No! Bad Jowie. So I'm having a bit of a situation here. Um, where I wasn't able to find any food for a while, both me and my ally are nearly starving. I gave the last bit of food I had to my ally, but it wasn't enough, and it is currently chasing me and trying to kill me. The only other sort of food I- oh, I just saw something over there, actually. I was gonna say- oh, something died. The only other source of food I could find is this other Jowie, and now they're both chasing me. But there's loads of food everywhere. Go on, get, get, get this food instead. I'm just gonna quickly eat this so I can heal up, because I'm in a precarious situation. I will- oh, it's rotten food. Oh, no. It was rotten. And are they getting up on me? Oh no, my ally's being attacked. But I wanted to be friends. Oh, let me quickly kill this one. Okay, look, we'll have this one. We'll share this one. <laughs> Just casually cannibalize that one poor thing over there. So that is clearly rotten food right there. We are still allies, even though it is trying to kill me, unfortunately. But I can at least quickly recuperate my food. And you are having a... Hard time eating? What are you doing? You know what? No, no, no. I'm not going to let you starve. There you go. Take my food. There you go, mate. Have a bit more before you really kill yourself. Yeah, you can see it's starving right there. I actually can't select it anymore. Um, That's deeply concerning, so I can't see the... Oh, uh, uh, hey, why? I can't see the progress on its hunger. This little thing's a right little a-hole. How's my maturation? I'm, I'm so close to an adult and it's currently spring. I think by the time I fully mature, it will move on to summer and I can't breed yet. Which is a shame because I really want to show you the breeding in this game. But I have a feeling I'm going to get hunted down before I can. Oh dear. Yeah, it seems like all the carnivores are, are starving right now. I'm just going to try and fend every, everyone off as much as I can and I guess defensively feed my friend. 
Oh my god, there's food everywhere! Why are you so mad at me? All I've done is try to protect you! I think it's invincible! Um, I've been biting it for a while now! Oh dear god, I have a god jow in my hands and it keeps on trying to kill me! Yeah, don't call at me after you try to eat me, Jesus! Oh well, <laughs> I guess I'm playing on hard mode now! Okay, well, the good news is I found a new Jowie. The bad news is that the god one is still chasing me down. And I don't have any foods to give to the new one to, you know, offer it as a friend. And I'm scared. <laughs> I'm scared. All right, this will appear to be my life now. Yep, this appears to be my life now. It just keeps on chasing me. New allies attacking old ally. Oh, but old ally is now fleeing. Or new allies fleeing and old ally is attacking. You can bugger off. Okay, now it's fleeing. You attack the other one instead, please. Like, can you two just, like, attack each other? That'd really make my life easier. Oh, oh, okay. It's actually kind of cool to see them interact. I actually don't think I've seen, you know, NPCs interact this much before in this game. This is really interesting. Oh, look at go. Oh, no, but I'm pretty sure that one's friend. Oh, no, no, no. That one's bad one. Oh, but that, that one's friend. <laughs> I really hope it can kill it. I don't think it can. I'm pretty sure I've watched a uh, new ally gain quite a few hits on old ally. Oh dear, oh dear. <gasps> no! Ah, oh, so I've been watching for a while then to attacking and the new ally got more than a few hits off, but yeah, this one's completely bugged out, which is really sad. This is my first time encountering a bug like this. I'm not sure if it's common or rare. I'm just going to pin it as really unlucky and, you know, for content. <laughs> I may as well look at it that way. It's definitely some content. The little bugger stole my food. Come back. No, no, you, you fear it. No! It's my food! Oh god, I'm dying. My jammy keeps on dropping. <laughs> I'm not having a very good time right now. Right, ladies and gents, I think this is the part where I lose my play. Um, as I am on very low HP, I'm, I'm having a hard time attacking this jammy. This one's gonna hit me, and there I go. <sighs> I really wanted to show you breeding in this episode because the little baby ones are so cute, but unfortunately I kind of got owned by a bugged out Jowie. It's um, unfortunate. So I really hope that you've enjoyed it. <laughs> it's really unfortunate that it happened. I've never seen it happen before. Of course it happens on video, but it's a really lovely game. It's really nice and chill. The sound effects are just really fun. It's quite immersive and it's adorable. I think it's so, so cute. And I definitely will be playing this again. It's again, I want to show you the babies. It looks really cute. But hopefully next time it actually works. You can just see it just eating me. Little wanker. Anyway, thank you all so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed yourselves, and I'll see you all again next time. Cheers.